dream. I'm marrying Mrs. Anissa, yeah, my beautiful wife. Marrying her, that's what I really care about. I don't really care about a big wedding or anything. As long as I'm with her, I'm happy. She is very bubbly, she has so much energy and when I'm with her I feel like, you know, there's no one else around us. Me and her in a, we're in our own little world and nothing else matters. And if you get someone that makes you feel like that, then they're definitely the one. So and I saw her being bubbly and excited and I was like, you know, I should go talk to her and see how she is. And from the first conversation we had, I got her number and we've talked literally every single day. Till today, we've just been together. We haven't been able to get away from each other. I think she's very beautiful. Aww. Maybe that's why I went out of Nigeria to get her. There's indeed no greater happiness beside being with someone you love. For Hanisa, in Muhammad, she found all the love and care she had ever craved for. We met through a friend, um, well, a good friend of his, and there was a work event, and we were, obviously, he approached me first. And we've been talking ever since for a long time, and we met again in person. <laughs> and that's how it went. <laughs> what other thing that made me excited is when he proposed. Um, we went to um, Switzerland and he took me to this waterfall place that I love so much and he went on one knee and proposed. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it, I couldn't even wait to say yes. I was like, can I say yes, can I say yes? And yeah, he couldn't even talk, so that was me. He's been very caring, generous, loving and he was there for me when I needed him the most. For Muhammad and Hanisa, having each other as partners is a feeling that is as deep as forever.